this prayer you are about to pray many miracles are going to come out of it say in the name of Jesus I declare that this body is the temple of the Holy Spirit therefore every sickness and infirmity in this body programmed to waste my life I command depart now open your mouth and pray depart fibroids depart high blood pressure depart cancer depart someone pray tumors growths depart blood conditions depart Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus. Say in the name of Jesus. I declare from today that I have a covenant of longevity. My body will never separate from my spirit until my time is done every premature separation either by accident by sickness by the activity of wicked people i cause it right now go ahead and pray no premature separation coming in the form of accidents hallelujah in the name of jesus please don't be distracted jeremiah 22 29 please give it to us quickly jeremiah 22 verse 29 it says "O earth 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 hear ye O earth 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 it says hear ye the word of the lord the earth is a universal point of contact the bible says as for the earth out of it comes bread it says the profit of the earth is for all and even the king is fed by that which comes from the earth i'd like you to pray say in the name of jesus my portion given to me by god i decree and declare through the ministry of man let it gravitate towards my destiny open your mouth and pray god is a god of portions god is a god of portions pray god is a god of portions Hallelujah. Say in the name of Jesus. Every negative inheritance that has been transferred to me by those who were before me, I decree and declare by the blood of the Lamb, I reject it right now. I reject it. Go ahead and pray. Every negative inheritance, inheritance, that has come as untimely death negative things closed doors i reject it someone pray 
Shapakatos and Brekatakatos. I reject it. I reject it. I reject it. In the name of Jesus, I reject it. Shabagada Barakos. Abrakatos Kateba Lakatesh. Hallelujah. Listen. The implication of having dominion over the realm of the air, the realm of water, the realm of earth is that no element that comes from these sources should work against you. Are you getting what I'm saying now? Judges, I, I, I was quickly trying to look for the scripture judges chapter 5 i hope i get it right let's look at 19 and 20. this was deborah and sisera judges 5. the kings came and fought i hope i got then fought the kings of canaan in tanakh by the waters of megiddo and they took no gain of money verse 20. yes it says they fought from heaven the stars in their courses fought against Sisera. Can I tell you, the elements of nature can hearken to the voice of those who know their God and can stand in partnership. Hold on. That means if someone goes to use the earth against me or pronunciations that go through the wind or water, provided is one of these elements. Did the Bible not say the sun shall not smite you by day? not the moon by night say in the name of jesus i speak to the elements of creation hear the word of the lord walk in partnership with the holy spirit and the word of god for my favor for my destiny not against me open your mouth and begin to pray the elements of the supernatural I decree and declare the sun shall not smite me by day the moon shall not smite me by night the scourging tongues of men shall not catch up with me I have dominion over the air dominion over the sea dominion over the earth 